Hi and Assalamualaikum guys. Today I would like to talk about our group project for subject E&D 530 which is we had to do a BMC video. Here we go. For your information, BMC is stand for Business Model Canvas. Before I start, I would like to introduce our group project logo. This is our group project logo, Sanif Boxes. First of all, let us introduce ourselves. The first member is Nur Shahira binti Musa. We call her Shira. Second member is Nur Ain binti Mahat. We call her Ain. Third member is Nurul Nadirah binti Rabi'an. We call her Nat. Fourth member is Nurul Izah binti Ja'fa. We call her Izah. And the last one is Nur Faza Atika binti Faizal. We call her Faza. Our company, Sanif Boxes, is selling colorful plastic shoe box. Our products are sell with affordable price, which is RM3 per box. And we have a lot of color types. Our product will be selling through online platform. So now, I would like to give an explanation about the benefit of our product. By using our product, you can organize your things such as your shoes. You can also clean and decorate your room. The right storage option helps neatly organize and leave enough space in the room for activities. Other than that, the shoe box are definitely the best way to avoid shoes and boots littering around the house. The shoe box are the best for organizing your footwear and avoid scratch damage and tears. Not only that, the shoe box can easily match to the room decor, hold a lot of shoes, also can alternatively use to store other items. You can buy more like 6 pieces or 12, piece, 12 pieces to make up a shoe rack. Our shoe box is able to carry around. Now, I will explain about the features of our uh, product. Our product is touchable and attachable, which is simple and fashion. Low flip design, easy storage and safe place, also detach easily and convenient to wash. This is the 9 element or detail of business model canvas, which is BMC, that we're going to explain later. First element in BMC is key partners. As you can see, our key partners is Shopee and Lazada. We buy the colorful shoes boxes from them and we sell it to our customers. Another element of um, BMC is key activities. A key activities for Sanif boxes will be social media management. We will update regularly the new release and the information as it is the only platform that we use to reach the customer. Another key activities for Sanif boxes will be marketing activities such as promoting the product that we sell on Facebook and Instagram. Other than that, we also designing the sticker for our product. And we also doing stock addition, especially when stocks are declining. A key resources for Sanis boxes would be our social media, which we are fully based on. So we have various platform, so that we can expand the range of audience reachability. Beside that, editing software are a must for Sanis boxes for our creating design like poster, teasers and product posts. Next is the value proposition of our company. We provide a budget friendly to our products. It only costs 3 ringgit for one shoes box and we do deliver our product as quick as possible because we use the best courier service for each area. Other than that, we also provide a high quality shoes box which is we use strong material of plastic to make our product. Our product also provide a ton of chooses colorful shoes box and customer can choose any of them that they might like. Last but not least, our company also sell a recently viral shoes box which might be the first choice from customer. 
customer relations is the relationship between we as a seller with our customer which we need to be in a good term with our customer in order to have a good business reputation so usually we will keep take all that to our social media like service view on facebook rating a poll on instagram story and testimonies and order from whatsapp now let's look at the channels for Sanif boxes. We are fully based on social media. We don't have any physical store, so we fully operate on Facebook. We also have an account on platform like Instagram and WhatsApp, so customer can choose which one uh, they want to use to approach us. For the customer segment, I divide the customer segment into three which is first user, second student, and third is sender. For user, there are three kinds of potential user that interest to visit our online platform, which is first, women who love to use box to organize their thing like makeup accessory, and they can use shoes box to keep their item. Second is, parents who have small kids might have difficulties to do physical shopping. Our online platform offer a good service for them to purchase Sunny's box as quick as very easy. And third is busy buyer that they can stop to our channel page and can quickly purchase Sunny's box that they need. For students, there are three kinds of potential why they interest to visit our online platform. First is students who have a lot of shoes and don't have any rug to organize their shoes. Sunny's box is a suitable item to them purchase to organize their shoes. Second is, with purchase Sunny's box, students don't have any problem with sketched shoes. Third is, students who live in hostel might have limitation of shoe rock. With purchase Sunny's box, can save some space because the box can arrange nicely. Last segment is sender, which we will provide a service such as cash on delivery for the customer who needs Sunny's box quickly. The cash on delivery will only do in the area near seller house which our business is located. Cost structure is we stock up our product and delivery costs. For example, we buy 10 units from our supplier to stock up our product. Revenue streams we get from our customer is clean profit and delivery charge. We earn this both from customer purchases. Hope you guys enjoy our video.